Hey, tricks just aren't for kids, they're for adults too. Yeah, we got Tom Interval here, local magician, as I like to call him, trickerer, sorcerer, a man of many talents here, is gonna teach us adults how to do some magic. Yes, thank you very much, Jenny. Thank you for the top hat here. Absolutely. Is this what your assistants wear? They don't wear the sexy garb. They, they nah, and they're a little shorter, like this size sometimes oh. when they're wearing that hat. <laughs> So okay. many people have worn that hat. Now, you had been doing magic since you were six years old, you said, That's right? correct. Uh -huh. That's when I started the hobby. My parents got me a magic kit, uh -huh. and I've been doing it ever since. I never grew up. Most kids go through a phase. Uh, I just never grew out of it. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. and what's really neat, though, people go see magic shows, but I feel like you can teach us some stuff we can do, like party tricks almost, you know? Yes. To entertain for, our for friends. Fam yes, for your friends and family. Prestidigitation, very st easy stuff to do. What was that, prestidigitation? Prestidigitation. Okay, so let, let's <laughs> kick some stuff off because you're going to show me some stuff. Yes, now this, I'm going to have a magic class tomorrow, which is why I was invited here. And well, in is a that why? In a, well, in a magic class, a lot of people think magic is really hard. Yeah. It doesn't have to be hard. Um, in fact, the things I teach are relatively easy, and sometimes the best tricks are the easiest. Yeah. And what they learn in addition to the tricks, like one example of a trick they learn is keep your eye on the ball, and I need a little room on my left. No offense, I don't mean to kick you out. <laughs> but if I were to take a ball like this and just have you blow on it. You want to blow on you? Oh. Just on the, yeah. Okay. Now, that's going to be the magic. Sometimes if you just do that, blow, blow. Perfect. Oh, perfect. Oh, blow, not spit. <laughs> okay, wait, don't want to blow again. Perfect. Yeah, that's blow, that, that's that, very well, thank you very much. That's a trick my students will learn. Now, I want to show you one other trick. And this one I will teach. And then after we do this one, I'm gonna show you a trick, or not really a trick, but a flourish. And you'll see what I mean in a moment. A flourish? Yes, a flourish is something you do that's fancy schmancy with the cards. Yeah. Um, I would like to show you a trick with these two cards. You'll see why they're significant in a moment. Now, I bought these cards at a thrift store, and magicians have to constantly be seeking unusual props to do magic. Okay. This, so I thought, this is a really cool deck of cards because all the backs are different. So as I go through, I'm going to deal them to the table. Say stop anytime. As I deal them like this, just say stop anytime. Stop. Right there, are you sure? Yeah. Stay or go? Uh, stay. Stay. We're going to mark that position. And I'm going to, con well, I'll tell you what. We're going to leave that on top. Let's do the exact same thing. As I do this, just say stop anytime. Stop. Right there, stay or go? Uh, go. Go. Did I tell you stop? You, any, yep, right there. Yeah. You want this here or that there? That one. That there? We're going to mark that position. Did I influence your choice in any way where you said stop? Well, no, I was looking at the pretty patterns. Exactly, and that's part of the misdirection, sucker. Did you just call me a sucker? Sucker? <laughs> <laughs> How dare you? Well, I like the pretty, I was distracted by the colors. Well, here's the cool thing. Now, these face-up cards indicate where you told me to say stop. Mm -hmm. So if I take out the card next to the one, uh, or the card next to the one where you stopped, and if I can find the other one here, da 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 da. Can I please have a drum roll? Da, 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 da. Thank you very much. Very good. I know I put rolls. another one in here. Ah, there it there is. There it is. So here's the cool thing. Now you stop me next to these two cards. Did you have a free choice? You stopped anywhere I wanted as I dealt, correct? I did it at my free will. Now here's the weird thing. Every single playing card has one card that's almost identical to it. Mm -hmm. I call it a soulmate. The soulmate of the nine of hearts, the only other red nine in the deck is what? Do you know? No. The nine <laughs> of diamonds, the card you stop me next to. Same thing with this. The only other red ace in the entire deck is the ace of diamonds. What are the odds of you finding the only card like that, right? I don't know because I don't do math, but, but mathematically I'm sure there's It's impossible, odds. but it's even weirder. It's not just that. These backs are all different. You actually found the only cards that match these no, backs. No, I didn't, because I looked at the flowers, not the horses. <laughs> but yeah. that's, that's not the weirdest part, though. The weirdest part is you selected the only red cards in a black deck. What? How did you do that? Very well. Now I'm just very confused. And all this right. is this trick they will learn in my class tomorrow. Okay, very neat. Uh, Tom, they're actually wrapping us, so we have to, I think you have... One more thing, or am I? Am well, I, I was going to teach you something, so yeah. I could either teach you a quick thing here. Do you, you want to do yours, right? Do we I have time have to do both? Too. I think so. We got to do it real quick, though. How many minutes? No, no minutes, like right. negative minutes. Negative really. minutes? Yeah. Well, I'll tell you what. Stand there. Okay. I'm going to show you how to spread a deck. We're going to get rid of all this junk. Oh, they're going to be so mad at me. Uh oh. In a hurry. Watch. Pressure's Whoa. on. You've seen magicians do this? Yeah. Easy to do. Spread. I'm going to teach you how to spread the deck. Thumb here. Okay. Pick up. Okay. Thumb here. I have a broken thumb. Oh, well, that's not good. Uh, you can do it. The fingers here. Okay. These two. Okay. This rests. Put it up here diagonally. Push down and try to spread the cards. Broom! 
Mm. Wow, that wasn't too bad. And I'll tell you what, since we're running out of time, I'll help cheat. I'll help you cheat. So you, that's what you do. You spread them. And then the easiest part, thumb here. Mm -hmm. No, your left hand. Yep. Now watch. Pick up there. I thought this was going to be a shorter lesson. It, it, uh, and it's like, no, no, pick it up like this. And it's like dominoes. <laughs> yes. And now Horrible. it's time for your trick if you have time. No, we don't have time. Oh, That's no. It. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to use up your time. That's yeah, okay. All right. So ta where can people sign up for your workshop? Uh, Interval Magic. Interval Magic. My name is I-N-T-E-R-V-A-L dot com. There's a banner on the lower right for the magic class tomorrow. Okay. Perfect. Starts tomorrow, lasts five weeks. And then also, if your friends are drinking, your tricks are going to be impressive. They're no much easier what. to fool people. Okay. Back to you guys.